previously on The Demon's Daughter. Well, her heartbeat is slower than usual. She seems to be more tired. What? What's going on? These symptoms Rainbow has, they're way too similar to the ones I had a year after I was brought to life. I've just received word that King Sombra, Queen Chrysalis, and Lord Tyrek have escaped their chosen confinements, and that they could be somewhere in Equestria preparing an attack. I don't think they're anywhere near Equestria. I got a note saying that a being called Hexar has them, but they're his apprentices. It also connects to Rainbow Sun Collapse last night. It's the same thing that plagued me all those years ago. You might not like this, but Hexar is... Our younger brother. Aren't you three able to stop him? We physically can't go into his realm. Only descendants of his components are able to do that. If you want to return Rainbow to normal, only you must go and stop him. But why does Misty have to go by herself? I'm going with her. Tenebris? She's your... A second cousin twice removed? No! My daughter! The goddesses had elemental components to look after Equestria. Their brother Hexar had powers to do the opposite. Seven, in fact. Envy, disharmony, tyranny, gluttony, lust, greed, and despair. How could I have not known that the seven warriors, with the seven entities that brought harm to Equestria before, most of all, me. Sister, how long has she been trapped in her room for? Since she got back from visiting the goddesses, I figured she wouldn't like what they had to say. That Hexar's component of despair is what she was born from? Well, yes. So, it wasn't the potion you were working on that brought her to life then? I'm afraid not. Oh, Luna, we've really messed up this time, haven't we? I wouldn't say that. Besides... Wouldn't you agree that having Tantris as a sister was one of the best things to happen in our childhood? I guess so. <laughs> Imagine what would have happened if we weren't bored. Very true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but then there's Rainbow Dash. Why must everything be connected to her as well? Venturing to fight Tenebri, becoming a goddess to fight Zephidos, and now becoming what Tenebri used to be? I'm sure there's a perfectly good reason for that, Celestia. One can only hope. You might not like this, but... Hexar is... Our younger brother. <sighs> Daughter of a demon god. That makes sense, right? I mean, just like the others, I threatened to take over Equestria. So why wouldn't I be related to- Ugh! Why? Why now? I thought I was free! I thought I finally got my happy ending! But this! 
Rainbow's in danger again and it's all my fault. I... I can't let her suffer anymore. I won't let any pony else toy with her emotions. I'm trying everything I can to keep her safe, but... Something else gets in the way. How can I even save her? I don't even know how to get there. Rainbow, why is this happening to you? This isn't fair. Why is she the one who suffers? It should be me. Why must they take her away? No one is there, even though she claims she's tougher. Insanity is not welcome back to stay. I love her, Rainbow Dash, more than I can dream of. So why is she in a flash? Gone without a scream Why her? Why must she be the only one who suffers because of me? If I don't hurry now She'll just be a memory this away why her why must she be the only one who suffers because of me if I don't hurry now she'll just be a memory why must she be the only one who suffers because So funny. I have never needed anything like this in my life until now. Give me that. Can't you see we're trying to do some research? Well, yeah, but I got bored. We've been here for hours. Our chance of little sister and our queen is going to a dark and potentially life-threatening place. Who knows what dangers could harm her? Would you two keep it down? My father's taking a nap and he said we mustn't disturb him. Uh, you're right. It's not guard-like to be freaking out like this. But it is sibling-like. After Sephiroth lost his wife, our land could not recover for a long time. Plus the fact he had some kind of immortality spell to keep his citizens from dying of starvation. Which resulted in some of us shrinking and getting red eyes. Guys, there's nothing to worry about. I'll be fine. I traveled beyond the Canaan lands before. But that was when you were still a princess. Are you sure you don't want a teeny little escort from us? No. As I've said before, you two need to look after our father whilst I'm gone. He's in more danger than I am to Hexar, so he must be protected at all costs. <sighs> yes, yes, your, your majesty. majesty. Brucus, Arcus, I think I've found something! 
What is it? It says that it's a journal by one of the past kings, King Lucho. That's my grandfather! The king of the Candlelands before dad! Ooh, history! Why do you think this might be a lead? I'm not sure. I just have a strange feeling. Seventh day of the fifth month. I had a strange encounter. Something that I would possibly fear, but never imagine seeing myself. I was caring for some of the plants just outside of the castle when I noticed something. It looked like some very valuable artifact, but I had no idea where it came from. It wasn't from inside the castle or one of our neighboring kingdoms. It was just laying there in the open, waiting for someone to take it as their own. I thought I'd better keep it in the castle to keep it safe. Suddenly, the ground shook when it did a giant hole formed, and from the hole came a figure, something that could come out of anyone's nightmares. So, you take the golden griffin vase as your own, I see, and not planning on returning. To the owners. Golden Griffin Vase? You mean this? Keeping it safe. Besides, if what you say is true about this belonging to the Griffins, then you must have stolen it from them. I'll return it to them in the morning. Just because it's called the Golden Griffin Vase doesn't necessarily mean it belongs to them. What? What matters is you stole the vase without a second thought. You're the perfect thief. I was not stealing it! You have no right to accuse me of greed, us kingdoms or anything, but we lend our powers to help our citizens, not keep it all for ourselves! <laughs> How long can you be generous? What would happen if one day you couldn't provide for your kingdom? You would need to get your nutrients from somewhere. Your kind would have no choice but to steal. Blasphemous! You speak such foul ideas, demon! I would never resort to stealing to help my kingdom! Be gone! Since you touched that vase, you have no choice but to come with me. I'm not going anywhere with you! But you've proven yourself worthy, your majesty. Worthy enough to be my apprentice of greed. You have shown you how what it takes to be the perfect stealer. Why wouldn't a griffin or a dragon be your apprentice instead? They are infamously far greedier than us. Yes, but their species were born greedy, not resorting to greed like your kind could. That's why you must come with me. Let my husband go! I'm sorry, but we've made a deal. You're not getting your greedy husband back. Coelia, go back inside! Lucho, dear, are you all right? I'm fine. As for you, if I were so greedy, would I do this? <laughs> you idiot! What have you done? I take it the base belonged to you. It was to test me, wasn't it? 
Well, I'm sorry to say that I don't fall for these sorts of tricks, Hexar. <laughs> you think you're not smart in me? The god will never crush you. You will become my apprentice one way or another. We can't let him get away with this. We need to stop him. I know. The first step will be to seal this hole so that no citizens will fall through. XR would stop at nothing to get his way. He opened a gateway down to his realm so it would be easier for him to take our child. But we managed to close it off before that could happen. It would never be opened unless it was with a royal kingdom's magic. That way, no, no citizen, citizen would be in harm's reach, reach of that, that demon. demon. So, my grandfather was originally going to be the apprentice of greed? Seems like it. But your grandparents outsmarted him. How? Well, they had a daughter, right? So she couldn't be taken by Hector. That's right. But maybe the reason my mother was hardly allowed to play with other kids was because my grandparents were so cautious and worried about Hector. Until she met Dad. And they got married. What is it? Did you figure something else out? Hexar's threat wouldn't make sense since my grandparents had a daughter. But when my parents married, my father became their son-in-law. So Hexar must have used that to his advantage. So Lucho and Suela had a son. But by law, Hexar's bargain still worked! We learned so much more about what Hexar is capable of. I'll need to let Nisty know right away. Huh? It's from Lyako! Dear Nisty, thank you for warning me about Hexar. My dad told me some stuff about him, actually, but I also found out some more info in the castle archives. Apparently the previous came before my dad wrote about him, my grandfather Lucho. This comes from his journal. He wrote about where the god is hiding, in a place called Nether Equestria under the Canaan Lands. The opening, the opening is enchanted, enchanted so, so only, only the powers, the powers of royal kingdom can open the gateway. gateway. So that, so that is, is why, why when you venture down to stop Hexar, I'm coming, I'm coming with, you. with you. It won't, it won't be, be treacherous for me since I'm also a descendant of Hexar. Well, well not, not as direct, direct as you, you but, but I'm the daughter of the Apprentice of Green. Green. You'll probably, You'll probably be too stubborn and say that I shouldn't go to help you, but I already made up my mind. I'm not just doing this to help you, but also my kingdom. Signed, Signed, Queen, Queen Liako. Liako. Oh, Liako. <laughs> I've moved past being stubborn. For this journey, I'm going to need all the help I can get. Tia, Luna, how long have you two been standing there? Oh, don't mind us. We were just leaving. Yes, we were. I'm sure you'll need plenty of rest to prepare for your journey tomorrow. I'll promise to return home safe and sound, you hear? And I'll do everything in my power to make sure my rainbow never suffers from my past again. Correct me if I'm wrong, Misty. But did you just say, my rainbow? Th that's not important! You know what I meant! Am I, Am I back, back, back in the, in the void? void? It's still really dark, so it must be. Wait, dirt? There wasn't dirt before. This is the second night in a row I've dreamt of that Philly scream. 
Is she falling down something? A hole? Why isn't my subconscious revealing anything to me still? This must be some kind of sign. But what? Why would I still be dreaming of a filly screaming? It doesn't make any sense. It's probably nothing. Though I've learned from experience that the same dream twice in a row has to mean something. I don't have time for that now. I have to say goodbye to my friends before I head over to Nethequestria. Whoops! Sorry about that, Tank. I guess I'm just a little distracted today. It's, it's quite, quite alright, right, Blue Streak. You just, you just need, need to be to more careful, careful of your surroundings, your surroundings especially, especially while, while cooking. cooking. I know, I know, but I am a genie after all. I could have just conjured a porridge out of thin air. But, but this is a good, good lesson, lesson for you. For you. Learning, Learning to cook to things from scratch, scratch is a good, good skill to learn for the future. For the future. And, maybe and maybe when Rainbow, Rainbow gets better, gets better I can teach you how to make her favorite cookies. I guess you're right about that. I mean, we all learn something about ourselves sooner or later, right? Wait, you can make cookies? I'll get it. Oh, hi, Nisty. What's with the bags? I came to say goodbye. What? <laughs> goodbye? Why? Well, where are you going? To a place called Nethequestria. It's where I'll find my fa- <sighs> The being who cursed Rainbow. Nether-Equestria? Oh, I know that place. You do? Remember when you captured Rainbow's friends five and a half years ago in a cell in Tartarus? I went there with the CMC and Spike to rescue them and discovered that time flows slower there than up here. So depending on how far down you're going will determine how much slower time will be for you. Wow, I honestly forgot about that. So much has happened since then. But now that I think about it, it does make sense as to why Hexar said seven surface days. It would be a much quicker time for him down there. Actually, Actually I, do I do remember, remember you mentioning, mentioning that back when I was when still I was sick. sick. Just, Just barely, barely, of course. Well, duh, you were basically dead when I first saw you. I still have nightmares about you haunting me. Anyways, is Rainbow awake? I'd like to say goodbye to her personally. She's, She's resting, resting right, right now, now, but you're but more you're than more welcome to bid her farewell. farewell. Alright, thanks for letting me know. Hey, Rainbow? Mist? I'm sorry to disturb your nap. I just came to say goodbye. <sighs> Goodbye. Where are you going? I'm venturing to cure you, Rainbow. I'm heading off to the Canaan Lands, meeting up with Liako, then we're going to Nethequestria to find the being who cursed you. You don't need to greet me here. Why don't I join you guys at your send-off? No, you can't. You need to rest. You're suffering with something you can't control, and it's my duty to fix it once and for all. When... when will you be back? Not sure. It's going to take a while to reach him, but it might be quicker depending on how far down I go. But I promise I'll return you to normal. I promise to make the thing that did this to you regret he was ever born. <laughs> Nest, you don't need to sound so tough for me. I can tell you're scared. Not just of facing this guy, but what could happen to me? <sighs> oh, Rainbow. I'm sorry this is happening to you. If only there was another way. I mean, why you? Why is it always you? Maybe because I attract dangerous villains like a magnet? So I can have something new to fight. <laughs> oh, Rainbow, you're ridiculous sometimes. There we go. You're no longer a worry ward. When you go, don't think of something terrible happening to me, but rather something I can easily beat. Think of that as my send-off. Oh, all right. Make sure you get plenty of rest and have Blue and Tank look after you. Drink plenty of water and eat plenty of food that isn't grief and- I'll be fine, Nist. I'm 25 years old. <sighs> I should be... fine. Yes! Were you two spying on us? 
Sorry, Sorry. we couldn't help it. Let's go! Come on, Nini! We're going to miss the train! Shh! Oh, sorry! Okay, let's board the train. Yay! It's a shame Rainbow couldn't be here to see you off. Oh, I feel so sorry for her. If I know Rainbow, she'll overcome it. She's not one to ever back down. Misty's right. Rainbow's never been one to give up on anything. She'll be fine. Rainbow, she's a good friend always. Someone you can depend on. I've known her for all oh so long. Good and bad days. Racing, running and flying. to blaze she'll be okay she'll weep this curse inside of her and banish it away and come away she'll come out on top and create the blue skies from the gray she not once a back town chasing her enemies out of town. With one punch, she stands without a single frown. Her confidence is here to stay. She'll be okay. She'll beat this curse inside of her and banish it away. And come what may. She'll come out on top and create the blue skies from the gray. She stood up for me for so many years, but deep down she knows that we are always here. She united us all forever as friends, but now it's your turn to fight until the end. She'll be okay She'll beat this curse inside of her and banish it away And come what may She'll come out on top and create the blue skies She'll be Inside of you and banish it away and come what may you'll come out on top and create the blue skies from the grave now Arriving at the Kingdom Lands. We hope you enjoy your stay. If you are returning, welcome back. Misty! Hey, Liako. You sure you want to come with me? It's not too late to back out. Don't be ridiculous. I told you, I'm the only one who can open the gateway. But you're their queen. You really shouldn't be. Save the chat for later, girls. We've got to get to the gateway. You ready? I am sorry about this, Grandfather. Well, wish us luck, everyone. Why didn't we just travel with them? There'd be no fun in that, Twilight! Train rides are fun! Before you go, We'd like to send you off with some helpful materials. What did you have in mind? 
You've been told that Nethequestria's time is much slower than up on the surface. This watch will help showcase how much time passes. Seven days up here will be much quicker time down there, so be cautious. Thank you, Lumina. For you, Lyako. This should allow you to still look after your land whilst you're traveling down to Hexar. That way, your father won't have to worry about the animals and trees suffering. But what if something happens to her? Don't worry. If that happens, I will help you a bit with the crops. Sajira! What? We're not captives anymore. Well, thank you anyways. And this is from me. What are these? These stones will allow you to sense the other apprentices of Hexar, including the ones not currently by his side. Would this mean I will know if my father is in danger? And Rainbow? Yes. It will work as an advantage for you, so you can prepare any attack from the apprentices who are allies with Hexar. Thanks again, goddesses. Or should I call you my aunts? Please be careful, Nisti. Our brother is nothing like what you faced before. Make sure you get back safely. I will. I promise. Please, please bring Dashie back to her normal sports-loving self! Please, please, please! Don't worry. I will, Pinky. Tia, Luna, if anything happens to me, I won't ever forget you. You hear? No. I can't be crying now. Get it together, Nisty. We will miss you too, Nisty. But we believe that you will make it out alive. It is something only you must do, after all. Thank you, sisters. <laughs> don't be God for too long here. <laughs> we don't know what we do without you. Arcus, Arcus, I told you, I'm going to be fine. Then oh, we're gonna gonna miss you. you. Oh, I know. Aw, Dad. You don't need to cry for me. I'm going to be fine. I know, but... I lost your mother all those years ago. I don't want to lose you, too. N no You're not going to lose me, Father. <laughs> Dang it! Now you're making me cry! I'm going to miss you, too, Dad! <laughs> All right, here goes nothing. On three. One, two, three! three. Are... are they going to be okay? They should be, though it seems like such a dangerous journey to be on. Aww! Why couldn't we go with them? Only descendants of Hexa are allowed down there, Pinky. Well, I hope it's not too filthy down there. I'm worried about Lyako's gown getting dirt on it. They'll be fine, Rares. What are we going to do if we lose her? She'll be fine, Arcus. She'll be fine. I hope so, too. Um, Dragon? Why are you still here? Should you be with the ponies on the train? Well, I had a long discussion with Twilight, and when she mentioned we'd be seeing Lyako and Nisty off, I asked her if it was alright for me to stay here for the week. WHAT?! I mean, as you know, I have a ginormous crush on Lyako, and you two are like her big brothers now, so I thought why not stay here to learn more about her before she returns. You have got to be kidding me. Sire, are you okay with this? Uh, it wouldn't hurt, really. But... What if he starts dating Lyako? Then they get married. Then he becomes the next king even though he's a dragon! Don't worry about a thing. I'm sure he'll behave himself whilst he's staying here. Won't you? Mm. Yes, sir. Good. I'll have the chefs prepare some jewels for you. He already knew about this, didn't he? This is gonna be so awesome, guys! We're having a week all to ourselves. Call it a guy's week! Guys week! Oh my 
in parentheses at this banquet if they can't accept my invitation. I'll just need to take them by force. That night will last forever! Looks like we might be due for a big old storm of chaos. I just have to get rid of her. Then Equestria will be mine! <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 ha!